Kaya Joseph lives in the Zeta Tau Alpha sorority house, which is located right in front of where the attempted kidnapping took place. Yeah, it was definitely pretty scary to hear, especially like it being like so close to home for all of us. That's brought up the issue of safety. That's why Safe Horns, a nonprofit started in 2016, is advocating for expanding private security and adding more blue light emergency call boxes. If your phone battery is dead, if something happens quickly, you know, they're designed to be in line of sight. Behind me is one out of over 300 emergency call boxes you can find throughout the campus area that dial 911 just by the press of a button and can be found along walkways building celebrated entrances and parking garages. Eight million dollars was allocated through the Board of Regents in 2019 to bring UT police into West Campus. Part of this money was for infrastructure, but the funding ran out. If we had cameras in the area, would this person already be arrested and off our street? The Austin Police Department released this sketch of the suspect. They describe him as a young Hispanic male with a muscular build and round face but the investigation is still ongoing. Christina Folsom, reporting Texas TV.